Listen, I have no idea how this reaction is going to perform, but I'm doing this because y'all told me to, and I told you that's how this channel works. I reacted to Jid Kenny Mason, uh, uh, Sheck West, uh, and J. Cole Stick yesterday, and I got a bunch of comments to react to Kenny Mason. I don't think I've ever heard him outside of, um, outside of Stick, the song. So, hey, if this video gets 2,000 thumbs up, we'll put Kenny Mason in the rotation. Yeah. This is how I showed y'all. Y'all run this channel. Y'all tell me what you react to. I just get my opinion. You know what I mean? I ain't the only, I ain't them, you know, other reactors just rap to what they uh, uh, like or what they can glaze. That ain't me. Coop. I keep it real. I just tell my, I just want, y'all want my opinion? I'll give it to you. We are. Hold on. Force the room. Goddamn. One is Nasty. Woo! We're on the road to a million subscribers, bro. We are 4,000 subscribers away. Oh, it's getting scary. Why am I scared? Uh oh, Ben the Thule. Little Blicky. What is that? Z Lock FN? What is that? They never show me a black guy, only a trout guy. When it sends out. So they ain't never show me a black guy, only a trap guy. Yo, I really hope this video gets 2,000 thumbs up. I could already tell this nigga nice. And, and if Jid and J. Corsa jump on a song with us, I know he nice. That is a powerful line. He talking about the images that we get. Um, we never see black guys, but we do see trap guys. Woo! A black guy, only a trap guy. When it sends out, so out of my last job, I started to crack cars. I can adapt, dog. I can dodge an attack. I can attach parts. Woo! Good kid in the city, but raising the mad parts. My blood on. Good kid in the city, but raising the mad parts. First of all, we're only 42 seconds in there. He already spit. Now, he don't rap like Kendrick Lamar, but he reminds me of that good kid, Mad City. You know how every time Kendrick comes out, he's like a new uh, uh, redesign, new evolution. He reminds me of Kendrick from the good kid, Mad City era. I ain't never seen a black god, black god, don't let your trap god, da, 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 da. like, wait a minute, go ahead, Kenny. Good kid in the city, but raising in bad parts, my blood on the asphalt, my brother with half eye, I told him what happened, he ready to crash out, my mama had passed that, yeah. Blood on the asphalt, my brother, he's, basically he's telling the story of maybe he got beat up or something happened to him, he went and told his brother, his brother was ready to uh, crash out, <laughs> crash test dummy mission, he was ready to go stupid. Yeah, damn, this nigga nice. How old is he? I mean, this was three years ago, so how old is he now? And I like the flow. He's committed to that pocket, and that's dope. Brother with half eye. I told him what happened, he ready to crash out. My mama had passed that. Yeah, too woke to know what awake me. I made it out of the basement. I look, he want to rewind that, because did he, is he talking about getting shot or getting, because my mama had passed out, because you got in a fight? Hold on. My blood on the asphalt, my brother with half eye. I told him what happened, he ready to crash out. My blood on my asphalt, my brother with half eye. I told him what happened, he ready to crash out. My mama had passed out. My mama had passed out. What is he, t is it, did he, did he get shot before? Because I would assume that's what it is. Maybe your mom passed out because you got beat up and it was so bad, but like, that's what I'm assuming. Yeah, too woke to know what a weight meant. I made it out of the basement. Too broke to know what a break meant. But not enough to do a break in. Still, I don't taste. Too broke to know what a break in, but no, not enough to do a break in. He's saying I was broke, but bro, I, I had morals. I wasn't going to break into nobody's house. I was just as broke as them. I love, I love that message too. Because it spits in the face of a lot of people. Be like, man, I did this because I didn't have money. And that's one of my biggest things. And it's like, that is a very, uh, I feel like a very American thing. Because in a lot of country, third world country shit, where I come from in Nigeria, that ain't, that ain't, that ain't a good enough reason, man. A lot of people ain't got money, nigga. Out of the basement, too broke to know what a break me. But not enough to do a break in. Woo! Still I don't take shit, cause sometimes I'm with nigga with glitching and goes. That I seen I hit kicking in those. That I seen I hit risking they soul. Is it earth for hell? I can't tell. My niggas loading up K shells. Thinking of holding up A shell. I know that I didn't want to age well. He said my niggas loading up K shells. Talking about holding up a A shell, like a shell gas station. Wow, and he really talking. He said, I've seen a lot of people 
with talent lose opportunities because they wanted to kick doors in. Now, this is what it looked like. That's how you could tell this nigga really from it because he's tired of it. Some of the people that glorify the darkest parts, you know what I mean, are I, clearly, it's like, sometimes be like, are y'all really from this? Because y'all clearly ain't tired of that shit. And when you really from it, been dealing with it your whole life, you tired of it, nigga. You want better for yourself. And that's uh, Kenny Mason. That, that's what I'm getting. From. My niggas loading up K shells, thinking of holding up a shell. I know that I didn't want age well. Not good at acting my age well. From age 12 to the grade 12, every reason to hate 12 came up here and tell me like a daycare. He said from grade 12 to age 12, I had every reason to hate 12. It just uh, it became apparent like daycare. Is that what he said? Every reason to hate 12 came apparent to me like a day came apparent to me like a daycare. Oh my came apparent. Why? You gotta hit him with the uh key to the cow. Why? Ooh, ooh. Nah, this what? Oh my god, I slept. Nah, this gotta hit 2000. Or y'all, y'all hating. <laughs> Every reason to hate 12 came up here and tell me like a daycare. Woo! Bitch, I'm original night game. You can tell by the night chain. Who gonna be here when my mind chain? Who gonna be here when the turn? And you know why he's actually, I uh, really like him? He's a definition of righteous and ratchet. This to me is, I really believe he, from the trench, like this is real gangster shit to me. Because... This entire song is basically about don't do... I've seen people lose opportunities from doing crime and doing dumb stuff. Um, I came up from this thing, but I'm not proud of this thing. Like, um, I'm, he, I'm glorifying the fact that I chose not to do this stuff, even though I am uh, 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 around this stuff. My brother's from this stuff, but the whole time, Blicky in his pocket. Because a nigga, that's what I've always said. I don't know why niggas got this feeling where blickies is only for gangsters. It's only for, it's like, no, nigga, when you need a blick, you have a blick. That is, it's not, it don't make you any more or less gangster. It means that, and the fact that he ain't talking about it and shit lets you know that, yeah, I, I wish I was out of this environment. I wish these things didn't happen, but I am still here, so I do need this in case. But which lets me go, yeah, this nigga ain't no bully. This ain't no nigga who gonna murder somebody and rap. This nigga is a nigga who's like, I, I want to make it through this, but if you if you try to test me, I'm gonna protect myself. That's just man shit. That's just human shit. Matter of fact, that's not just human shit. There isn't an animal in the world that you don't corner or go try to attack their family and they don't go, they don't crash out. From a, from a lion to an ant, nigga. That, I like him. I'm more like him, bro. It's like, yeah, I got the gun on me, but it's not like... Why y'all niggas think it was gangster? Bang, nigga, no. Get off me. It's just a little bad. Get off me. That's all that is. Who gonna be here when the time? I'm sorry for the rant, but this nigga too real, bro. This is what I've been This is what it looks like when you're not glorifying gangster shit or being a gangster, but you're talking about where you came from. That's what this looks like. A lot of people get it twisted, go. I've seen rap be like, man, I don't glorify jail. It's like, nigga, yes you do, bruh. If all one of your raps is how tough you were because you went to jail, and I ain't do this because I was in jail, or oh, you ain't, you ain't tough if you didn't go to jail, then yes, you are glorifying jail, nigga. Stop it, bro. Some of you niggas don't know what glorified means. You absolutely are. This is what it looks like when you're not glorifying that shit. You're just telling your they story. They want you to pray to the most high. To me, that's a crackhead in the city with closed eyes. Pray to the most high. To me, that's a crackhead in the city with closed eyes. Meaning that niggas ain't even seeing how dark it gets. How the most high. They talk about God when they say pray to the most high. He said the most high is a crackhead. I ain't never seen nobody. Yeah, them cluckers are the most high. And it, it shows you, yeah, he's fr a good kid in a mad city, bro. <laughs> a city with no God and pin on a nosedive. Spinning a block and spinning a long time. Pretending I don't cry. I be telling a lie the day that I tell you I don't lie. My mom on the phone line. Pretending I don't cry. I'll tell you a lie the day I tell you I don't lie. You know how I said Central C gotta be one of the realest rappers ever? 
This nigga might be the American version, bro. Ah, man, let me not say that. Central C will talk about shit that like everybody can relate to. If you ain't from the from this environment, you might not really relate to this. But I love what he's saying, bro. But Remind me to tell you when I make it home now. I'm reaching my goals now. The notes in my phone resemble a gold mine. I'm here on my. But also, I, the notes in my phone resemble a gold mine. But also, what you more people gonna relate to a nigga like this than a nigga like King Ron or like Chief Keith or something like that. Because you don't even necessarily have to be from trenches. You just got to be from conditions that make it that you got to protect yourself. Really, then you understand that. So. Oh, now. I thought a few goats should reach out and show how to maneuver the game. But it feel like their goal is keeping us closed out. Keep it on me for sure. It ain't for sure. It's show. It's going to be the last shit you see before. A side of me they never seen before. The heat in the heat, the cold. The rain, the sleep, the snow. The heat of the heat. The rain, the sleep, the snow. This nigga stupid. Yeah, tell him you. It ain't never. Right, by this point, yeah, you could tell. Tell him you got the the iffy on you. Yeah, I keep the heat on me. That ain't me saying, but I, it's the contest. That ain't me just you know. It's more like how I do gun bars, where it's like I'm not a gangster. I'm not saying I am, but nigga, for my me and mine, it's <laughs> you feel me. Niggas will crash. You feel me? So. I like to respect any father, any man, any, let me not even just say man, any human, any creature would. You know? A foe, impose defeat, and fold him. He never been on this street before. Shoot him for a swallow, fruit for knowledge that I seek. Shoot him by the cardo, he like cardo, give him ways. Play that gun on you like Marcos, if his car get low, okay? Nigga, we are. Gun on you like Marcos. Woo! I gonna go out one day, make no difference if it's today. I know my dog bitch stepping on shit. If he'll get caught, he never gonna quit. I know that five be waiting on shit. No more. He said my dog stepping on shit. If he don't, if he don't get caught, he never gonna quit. And I love that lyric too, cause it leaves it open to be like, wait, are you, are you saying that's a good or a bad thing? No, nigga, I'm just saying it's a thing. He's so real. He talking about his dog, like, yeah, that nigga stepping on shit. But if he don't get caught, he's never gonna stop. This nigga has a problem. Like that is dope. Won't try they catching on quick. No hog on slime. They sitting up licks. I know they fine. They sitting up hits. I know my mind been sitting on tricks. Yeah, I've been practicing pushing my brain. You start changing the way that you look at shit. Then the shit you start looking at change. Woo! Now you looking at change. Change the way you start looking and the way you start looking changes. I'm forever original nine game. You can tell by the nine chain. Who gonna be here when the time change? Who gonna be here when my mind change? Oh no, we need more Kenny. We need more Kenny, bro. Oh, his name is Kenny too. Is that show for Kendrick? Is this full man Kendrick? <laughs> That'd be crazy. Oh yeah, nigga. Do me a favor, hit that little uh, thumbs up button. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm waiting for this underdog right here. Underdog, get, let's get you some money. This section is brought to you by Underdog Sports, the number one app where you can make money by making picks on your favorite athletes. If you download the Underdog Sports Fantasy app right now, link's gonna be in the description and use the promo code SFJ, my initials. When you deposit 100, we're gonna throw another 100 right on top of that. Free money, go ahead, take that, make your picks. Today my pick, they got Brooke Lopez for 18.5 points, rebounds, and assists. I got him higher, why not? 